Ah, this is going to be fun, because here comes the Ninja Master, the Master of Martial Arts. The following is a Fatal 4-Way match. Making his way to the ring from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira Tozawa. An amazing striker and high flyer. Tozawa can do anything. Yeah, he even got over his divorce from Tamina. Gentlemen, the ninja battle is about to begin. Mello is money. Opponents. First, from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. I hate to parrot a catchphrase, but Mello really is money. Multiple title reigns and main events to his name already. And this guy is destined to continue that success in all of WWE. Time for Mello to make that money. The skyscraping Shanky is here. And from India, weighing in at 341 pounds, the skyscraping Shanky. How great is it to finally see Shanky breaking free from Jinder Mahal? Only a fool would reject the guidance of a former WWE champion. Saxton, sit down. Stop dancing. You look foolish. I can't help it. My hips are on fire. Woohoo! Here comes the Scottish Supernova. An accomplished superstar who has made his name in NXT and WWE. And from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 178 pounds, Noam Dar. Noam Dar the first ever Israeli-born WWE superstar. The Scottish Supernova has done Scotland and Israel proud. The only man to hold the NXT UK Heritage Cup Championship more than once. That's a testament to the pure wrestling skills of the Scottish Supernova. Highly skilled. He's the first Israeli-born superstar to compete in WWE. He's got a, bit of, a little bit of his own swag going, too. He's smug. He's not smug, Cole. He's confident. Fatal four-way match underway. This should be interesting. In each corner, you see Akira Tozawa, Carmelo Hayes, Shaky, and Noem Dar. He thinks he has it. Broken up, and the match continues. That's teamwork. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. This won't end well. Uh-oh. I don't know what they're looking for.
looking for here. And well-timed maneuver there. I like this strategy. Find an ally, glue this together, and settle it between the two of you at the end. electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. He's ejected from the ring. Oh, a kendo stick wrapped around the head. Corey, what are the perils of this match that superstars must be concerned with? Well, this is the type of setting where you must be aware of outside interference because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. It's legal. The match can change in an instant when another individual who is not officially part of the match makes their presence... Wrapping the leg here. Wrapping the leg. Oh, my. And he breaks the submission. Super kick finds the mark. He's getting a little batter now. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Targeting the chest. Very effective. Re-entering the ring now. Put into the corner. Oh, my. Carmelo completely dictating the pace here. Shanky has to turn this around in. Quick. He's looking to unload on his opponent with that kendo stick. Lifts their opponent's uh, legs and oh, just go out. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Oh, it's right to this. Cover, cover. Stops the count before it, too. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. The leg trip. Fisherman suplex. Getting tossed around. It wasn't the height or distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. That'll ring your bell. Tazawa feeling confident. He's losing precious seconds here with this display. That was showing great awareness of positioning. Placing yourself between the ref and your opponent. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show up. He'll head to the ring. Zawa. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh, my. Oh, my. Looking for something, anything under the ring. He's got a sledgehammer. And you better believe his opponent's name is all over it. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Roaring European uppercut. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Spinning back elbow connects. Canadian destroyer. And that looked like a terrible landing. That might have caused some serious issues. We'll have to see what happens. Flat ladder. Face first with a waist lock takedown. Thrown back in under the ropes. Driven into the barricade. Tozawa feeling confident, but he's losing precious seconds here with this display. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Step up in, Zagiri finds its mark. Net breaker! He is just reeling from that offense. This match certainly has taken its toll. Keep it up with three other superstars will wear you down. Shanky just hamming it up, luring his opponent in. Uh-oh. Letting his opponent know respect is earned, and he's still a dollar short. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. And he gets set back into the ring. And now gets tossed into the ring. Look at this. Trying to shatter the ankle. Another knee drop. DDT. This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges. So much could go wrong very quickly. Bad predicament right here. Tozawa feeling confident, but he's losing precious seconds here with this display. And 
he's taking this to the outside now. Oh, what a bump to the face! Taking this outside. This could be good. Up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Neck breaker countered it just in time, right across the face. From behind, back suplex. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Well, this deep into a fatal four-way match, you gotta expect to be a little worse for wear. Was ready for that. And the confidence and cockiness of Hayes on display now. Double flapjack. Oh, my. Kick to the gun. Right the wrong into a neck breaker. Showing out their deadlifting prowess and just tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Close line. performance outlasting three different opponents. It was a real testament to his abilities. 